January 13th of 2019. This was not another day in the life of Karim Benzema. He woke up like any other, it's true, but it would end differently from the others, as someone who wants to play with destiny must understand that the same destiny is the one who shuffles the cards, and we the people who play with it. And once the fact happened, we thought, if I had done such a thing like this, this would not have happened to me. But what's the point of regretting, once the fact has been consummated? Real Madrid faced Betis in a league match, and the French striker would retire from the field of play after injuring his hand, after a clash with Marc Batra, a former player and rival in Barcelona. Karim Benzema was being one of Real Madrid's best players at the Benito Villa Marine and was unable to return to the field after the break. An unfortunate play with Marc Batra, in which both were struggling for a ball, caused the Frenchman to fall with such bad luck that he fell on his right hand, suffering a fracture of his little finger. The play that caused Benzema's injury occurred just before half-time. The striker left with clear signs of pain and stayed in the locker room after the game resumed. Real Madrid issued a statement confirming the injury. Following the tests carried out on our player Karim Benzema by the Real Madrid Medical Services, he has been diagnosed with a fracture in the phalanx of the fifth finger of his right hand. Evolution is pending. The evolution was pending. The fracture was known, but it was not known how long it would take him away from the courts. And as we all know, a bad blow to the hand can bring eternal consequences, including early osteoarthritis. After being injured, the first news were that Karim Benzema would be out for up to two months if he underwent surgery to fix the broken finger. The player, who had already been postulating himself as the best substitute for Cristiano in that first season without the Portuguese at Real Madrid, decided to wait until the end of the season, so as not to leave the team without his number nine and emblem. Days later, Santiago Solari would confirm what every Real Madrid fan wanted to hear. The Frenchman could play with his injury. And as someone who doesn't want the thing, it would end up giving rise to one of the most iconic features in Benzema's physical appearance, his bandage. At that time, the bandage was more cumbersome because it had to protect the recently fractured area. At the end of the season, the striker decided to go under the knife to have his finger properly placed because the bone has also not consolidated in the best way. As there was no longer any sporting activity, the Frenchman didn't miss any minute of the game. The operation went well, but required two months of rest, but the calendar did not allow it, and the player ended up joining the group earlier than it was expected, so he does not miss any game. However, things don't always turn out as one imagines, and that is how Benzema suffered a new blow that would damage his finger again. The season starts with Karim with the same bandage and with an operation that in the end has not solved the problem but has gone unnoticed. Since then, the striker has played with a bandaged hand, much more out of necessity than superstition. Although it is true that curiosities of football, his best years have come with his bandage that already distinguishes him in each game. Since then, the Frenchman has not found the time to stop and go through the operating room again. But the few times that the Frenchman has left his hand exposed, the state of his little finger, very crooked, has been appreciated. So he is forced to protect himself in each game to prevent him from suffering a new fracture. That Karim has been able to adapt to this situation is confirmed by the numbers. Not only has it not suffered, but every year it improves. In the last campaign in 2021, there have been 34 goals, 30 with Madrid and 4 in the European Championship with the France national team, his second best record of his career. As it was not sufficient, he signed another 30 in the campaign of his injury, plus 27 and 11 assists in 1920. Karim will have to fix his battered little finger one day, but he doesn't seem to be in a hurry and he doesn't lack reasons, especially if he's superstitious. But that bandage is already the history of Real Madrid. Football, his own style and who he really is, Karim Benzema. This was why Benzema plays with a bandage on his hand. If you are looking for another player you want to know better, check out our video on Edouard Mendy. If you enjoyed watching this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel 
and turn on the bell notifications so you don't miss our future videos.